Um, g'day guys, it's Roy from The Age here. Um, Simon, just be keen for your thoughts on the game and how it all played out today. Um, oh, I thought we were pretty poor, to be honest. Um, I mean, the obvious thing was we shot the ball poorly, um, finished around the rim poorly. Um, but those weren't really the indicators that we sort of pride ourselves on. Those are just things that happen. Um, what I was a little disappointed with from us probably seemed like we were, we were a little manhandled. Um, they seemed a little harder at the ball. Um, I didn't like us giving up so many offensive boards, which is kind of a key for us. And we were, you know, it was a real key focus for us going into the game to, to make sure that we looked after the ball and that uh, and we kept them off the boards. Because um, we figured, you know, like after what happened to them the other night in Melbourne, um, they're going to come back pretty hard. And, you yeah, know, basketball gods were smiling on them. Um, they couldn't drop anyone in the ocean last night, the other night. And then obviously they come out hot in the first quarter. Had to try and ride that. And usually if, you know, we can just get our defence right, um, we'll go on some sort of run, but it just never really happened for us tonight. Um, and a lot of it was, you know, you've got to tip your hat to those guys. Um, I thought Xavier Cooks was really strong tonight. Every time we seemed like we might have been wrestling just a fraction of um, control, uh, he seemed to make a play. Um, but, yeah, one of those nights. I know it's always a thing laymans look at it and say, oh, there were lots of three-point shots missed tonight. But what's your assessment of how the offence sort of handled things and the and the shot selection and sort of how, how you went about it? Yeah, no, I'm not, not real concerned. Like, we're one of the lower three-point shooting teams in the league, despite what everyone bangs on about. Um, I think we're at 22 and a half per game, which is actually too low. Uh, that was up a little bit tonight, but I didn't think our shot selection was great, particularly early. Um, seemed to suffer a little bit of anxiety from a number of guys. I thought our, um, our ability to find guys, like we make play, get feet in the paint, kind of forced up some mid-range. Yeah, just stuff that we, we, we haven't been doing. Um, but again, credit to, to Sydney, um, their pressure on the ball um, and their physicality was, was really strong and, um, and we didn't make the adjustments. Uh, Mitch, what was it like out there tonight? What, what was your assessment of how the guys sort of handled, particularly that, that start when they came out there? Um, <clears throat> I think the feeling was that we just we didn't have any mojo offensively and defensively they made a couple of shots we didn't get really too deterred but offensively we just didn't really have any good flow uh, we talk about pace and space a lot at our ball club and it's no you know no secret that's when our offense is at our best but it, it felt like we had no space and no pace and you know we were trying to throw different looks and different guys and it just didn't feel like it clicked tonight. Um, the, time, the times we did get stops defensively, you know, I, th I thought we did a great job, but then offensively we'd kind of shoot ourselves in the foot and then they'd get an easy bucket or, you know, we'd, we'd kind of hurt ourselves there. Um, turnovers for us just that killed us, you know, I had a couple of really bad ones and trying to find guys instead of sometimes just being a bit more aggressive and taking those shots happened to a few of us tonight, but some of the ones we should have shot, we passed and some of the ones we should have passed, we shot. So um, we'll be okay. You know, we know we've got a, a very deep roster offensively. We know we're very well rounded in offensively, but you know, defensively it wasn't there, and, and offensively we just, you know, we weren't at the level that Sydney were tonight. And, and full credit to them, they got their their asses handed to it, and I know they know that as well. And we knew they were going to come out and put up a great fight tonight. So we were ready for that. But in saying that, we definitely weren't ready at the same time. Question for Dave. Uh, so Simon, with um, with the. Uh the bench, what was your assessment of what you got from your bench? Because it seemed like you really struggled to get too many guys to give you something off there tonight. Um, oh, I wouldn't be pointing the finger at the bench whilst it wasn't their most productive night. I, it was pretty much all, all of our team had a bit of an off night tonight. Um, you know, some guys who played solid basketball, I thought Joe was pretty solid. Mitch had some good moments. Um, Zaya maybe in the fourth, but I wasn't particularly pleased with the performance of anybody else. Um, and yeah, that's um, you know, our bench, our depth is something that we pride ourselves on. Um, and it's something that uh, has, has given us some success early in the season. So we need, to see, we need to see that productivity out off them. Last question for Dave. That's right, I'll, I'll step in. Simon, um, you mentioned Joe just there. He seemed to get better and better at both ends as the game went on. I think you'd be pretty happy with what your 
you're getting from him right now? Um, yeah, for sure. Uh, he's um, he's a really good player, and the more time he spends with us, the more repetitions he gets in our offense. Um, the more we learn where to find him, um, I think the better we'll get. Another good test now on Thursday against against the Hawks down in Wollongong. Yeah, they're all good tests. Um, every game, you know, um, saw last night, um, tremendous game between the Hawks and New Zealand, and uh, you know. New Zealand coming in a little wounded, and, and and it's always a dangerous game when you've got a wounded team, and we saw that with Sydney tonight. Um, so yeah, we'd be a better, need to be on our best um, our, our, our game to to go and uh, succeed in Illawarra. Thank you, Mitchell. Thank you, Simon. Thanks, dudes.